have found one voice. What we are asking for today is that our government recognizes the value of rural PEI. It's time to stand together and stand up for rural Prince Edward Island. How much have they taken from rural PEI? They've taken our schools, health care, federal and provincial services, funding for fisheries and agriculture. We had half the ferry service last year. Prince Edward Island is a special place, but it remains small and rural, despite what Charlottetown and Summerside think. There is no urban-rural divide. It's all rural. So Premier McLaughlin, I'm asking you to leave our schools alone. We're here today to say rural schools are not closing, rural hospitals are not closing, and rural communities are not closing. The school issue right now is what we're trying to do is a child-centered uh, school system where the focus is on the child. And right now what we're debating is, is uh, bricks and mortar. We have so many positive things in this province that we need to pull together, and that's why it's great to have this. This is our democratic system where you come together and in this 60-day period, because there have no decisions been made on the school's issue, it hasn't come to cabinet yet.